Hello, my name is Dark Wolf Hunt, and welcome back to another video. And on today's video, we are going to be trying Train Simulator, but in VR. Uh, we are doing a short journey of 18 minutes to from Brighton to Luz. So let's see how this goes. I, well, obviously, I have tried it to see if it's working, and it works fine. So let's go and uh, get sick on a train, maybe. Right then. I mean, it feels really good. It feels like you're sitting in the cockpit. No, well, cockpit. Train pit, driver's seat, whatever. Something like that. Um, right, and so one problem I do have is trying to... I'm not... It breaks off. The master switch. Right, switch off. Because... I can't choose it. How do I do this again? I can't remember. Uh, the master key. Come on. Right. Look at that. Can I do that? I mean, look at it with my. Where's my mouse? I don't know where my mouse. So this is the only problem I have. I don't use a keyboard or anything like that, which would make it uh, a lot simpler. Look, you can do the door, see. There, we got the things back that we need. Erection switch. It's in driver's seat, right? Nope. So it does show up if you look at stuff, but it is. There. Right. The master key. So, where is that? There it is. What is it asking me? To... Okay, then for a second. Okay. There we go, right. Let's uh... close that door. No, door. Sit down. I think we're going to be late in this one. Um, have I opened doors? Where, where's my train thing? Left doors unlocked. Supposed to be gone by now. I haven't locked the doors. Doors unlocked. Pretty sure I'm not missing anything there. Why are you messing around with me, game, when I'm trying to do this, eh? Oh, I know why. Nope, you, you won't do that either. Um, we should just quickly reset. Right. Master key. Which is... That door's unlocked. That's the key on. Long door. Why aren't these doors unlocking? Well, this is going well for a video. You knew I should have drove the train I drove earlier. At least that worked. Oh, now, now it's loading passengers? What the hell's going on? The writing's all a bit blurry, so I can't actually see 
what is on the control panel. Well, I have all my buttons mapped out on the controller that I'm using. So it should be fine, technically, theoretically. Uh, but anyway, yes. Ugh. Load passengers. I'll just go out there and close that door again. Right. We've got 30 seconds before we got to leave. Left door's locked. I'll quickly check that. You lied to me. But, right. Right. Yes. Oh no. That's it. Next door. Driver seat. Direction switches off. Oh, what? There we go. So, brake power. There we go. Now we are finally off. <coughs> Excuse the cough. I still got a cold. So we are off now. Hooray! Headset a little bit. <coughs> oh god. Ugh. So yeah, train simulator and VR is a really nice. Sit down in my chair, as you can see down here. Don't want to go too fast. Breaking the speed limit. And of course, if I want to, I can get up and lean out the window if I wanted to. All right, but let's just get going, first of all. Let's turn a brighter down there. Hello, people! God, the models look worse in fear. I know they're supposed to be from a distance, like, and all that. And it looks fine when you're looking at it through a monitor, but... VR is so much fun to do. Oh, we've got to stop here. Uh, okay. Are the doors going to work? That is the question. Uh, we're on time, so that's not too bad. Hello, people. Hello. Hello. We had enough time, we can go out and have a look around, but we do not, so we can have a quick look around at the end of this when we get to lose. Hooray, the doors are open. I'm not a complete failure. Right. Oh. Let's get a bit hot under the VR, but yeah. As you can see, I've still got my, uh, I don't know why I'm pointing here. It will make sense if you look at it at my point of view, but still got the AP up there and all my signs because I'm trash at this game. Can actually go a little bit earlier. Started. Get ahead of time. Right. What were headlights? Was that H? That's H. Sorry, can't map everything I'm trained to. Headlights on. Day running. That's what we want. Ooh, a dark tunnel. Okay. Could turn the cab lights on, but I feel so cool doing that. <laughs> Let's put the power up. Our next one is Moscum. Never been there personally, but you know, we can still look outside as well like this. 
See the train in all glory, it's 3D. And if I had enough time, I can actually go back there and uh, go and speak to the passengers if I want to. No, stuff them. Uh, what speed? That drift, because we're coming into our next station. I think I'll just start breaking. That might help a little bit. Hello, train! I'm just going to pull the brakes on really hard there. Gonna have a quick look around. Hello, hello, passengers. Right, so you can get out. Let's have a look around. Where are we? We're in Moosecombe. See all the passengers who are not on our train. Uh, right. Oh, steps. Little grey, that little grey dot that you've got to try and find to activate stuff is really annoying. I wish it was stuck on the actual movement of the VR, but this game is not built for VR. So, thanks some lucky brainy people who came up with the um, program that runs this. Uh, UE, yeah, and UE VR, Unreal Engine VR. So basically, you can play any Unreal game, I believe, or pretty much any Unreal game in VR. And I would like to try Cyberpunk at some point. Playing Cyberpunk in 3D, or oh, in VR, sorry, would be awesome. But no, that will be another day. But now, I'm just trying the basics out on this. So, a 1.6 miles to farmer. Farmer. Fair enough. We're going to see the farmer. Right. Just sit back and relax. This is definitely more immersion now. Window open. Have a look at the beauty of the outside. Max speed, 100 miles an hour. Do, do monitor touchscreen enabled. I have no idea what any of that means. I know what monitor means. I know what touchscreen means and I know what enabled me, but let's just... Dog monitor. Yeah. It's a little bit blurry on the... Uh, VR. Uh, you must have probably seen a better resolution than I am, actually. But the fact that you can do this is just cool. I've always loved VR. I think I ranked a little bit too early. Not coming up to a red light near. Yeah. So there is a station somewhere up there. That's pretty cool because you can move your head now and just look around the corner, see if anything's coming. Here we are. Mm, got 20 seconds to go. I think we're going to get there in 20 seconds. We might not be on time, but that's realism for you. Trains are never on time. Not English trains anyway, so. Hello, my lovely passengers out there. 
Hello. They're all bloody miserable. Anyway, to be honest, anybody paying for the train ticket is going to be bloody miserable. They're too bloody expensive. Public transport is supposed to help people out. Not bloody rip them off. Got these people coming in. Come on in, ladies and gentlemen. It's all right. Before I get too far. Uh, that, that's... Ugh. I felt weird. It didn't go just down. It went like... Down in a curve. Yeah. Oh, hello, Ruth. Ugh. That's a bit weird. But it's cool. Cause if I had enough space, you could, I could just stand up and walk around. But... I've got a wall there. I can't really see, but... Yeah. Come on, people. I've got to be gone. I'm so late. Uh, we've got 4.4 miles to go. Let's go and see the passengers. Hello. Uh, oh, we got a passenger. All right, shall we? Hello, Mr. Bean here. Mm -hmm. I should go and drive the train. Uh, do, 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 quickly, quickly, quickly. Oh, what speed are we? Ah, oh. you're all right. Oh, we're in the tunnels. Feel good. Everything's all lit up. How fast we're going and all that. So cool. <laughs> so yeah, if you got VR and you like trains, I highly recommend this. It's so cool. And this is the kind of experience I like. And yes, VR gaming isn't quite so cheap. I mean, you can get the Oculus Quest 3, which is supposed to be really good. I've never played it myself. And that come out. Starts at £350, so not too bad. You can hook that up to a PC. Play these types of games, so. <coughs> Excuse me. Ugh. I'll be glad when I got rid of this cough. It's doing my head now. I feel so tired. Oh, I've got to go down to 55 miles an hour. Two and a half miles to go. Lovely. Oh, look. Oh. Somebody's old caravan back there. I don't know why I keep putting on this accent for. I don't come from Cornwall or anything like that. Well, I do love me cider. Oh, 69. <laughs> I just love this. Sitting down, relaxing, just looking at the fuse. All right, they're not the greatest. Um graphics in the world, but they do. Oh, we've got red light coming up. Bring it down to 55. Just about yellow there. I need that red light. Oh, it's turned yellow. Good. Should be all right. Station just after it. Brilliant. Oh, another tunnel. Bridge. 
feels so weird. But I love it! I want to slow down a bit. It's sad. I wish other trains would recognise me. All right, we've got to come down to 10 miles an hour anyway, coming into this station. It's weird trying to talk with the VR headset because it's pushing my cheeks down. Uh. Uh. Sorry, I'm just all giddy. What have we got here? Ten. Uh. Yes, I know I'm way over the speed limit. That's not my fault that you got a really bad speed limit coming into here. Oh, we are in lose. Oh, this is our fun. Wow, that was quicker than 18 minutes. It felt like. Unless you're watching a video, it probably felt like a whole day. Go and take a quick look around Luz afterwards. And we are on time pretty much. I'm happy with that. <coughs> and that's all we had to do. Go out and have a look in a second. Just unload these and finish off this scenario. I'll keep again. Keep trying to get that grey little dot on there to like point there, but it's not. It's on the actual joystick, which is annoying. Uh, uh, it's what it is. Okay, what do we get? A gold. I am happy enough with that. Right. Free room. Get up. Go and take a look around outside, shall we? Have you just come out of prison? Look at the hair. Got no hair. Got coffee. Wow. Those are some 2D pictures there. Still, it's not about flowers, it's about trains. And it looks so cool because they look so big. It's as if I was there. Here we are, we can have a look at the tiny table. Bins, rail upgrade or work. Of course, we can't go in there. <coughs> <coughs> Let's try and break free. Back into the station. Damn it. Trying to break out. Take a bit of a was around here. Let me out. We we'll walk on the tracks, why don't we? Hmm. How do we get to that bridge? Let me in. I want to know your secrets. I mean, there is a free camera. Well, I can use, but I can't remember what button it is, and I can't bother to look.
do 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 do. The red means you can't be on here. <laughs> oh, that looks like an open. Oh, there's some walls everywhere. Got to break free. Can't even jump in this game. This game doesn't let you jump. I want to go and visit that mansion up there, up on the wall, up on the wall. On the hill. You can run through the trees, though. Hmm. Hmm. What about over here? No. The open world in the game sucks. Bah. Might as well run down to the next station, or is this the bridge? Need to run faster in this game. <laughs> There's no jumping. Hello, train! Remember, kids, you shouldn't play on the train tracks. <coughs> Unless you're in virtual reality. Could there be a bit of a gap in here? <laughs> <coughs> oh, we can't go no further. There is an invisible wall all the way here. I, I want to go down there and see. Let me be free. Oh, well, right. That is the end of this video, I suppose. Uh, right. Let's stop like that. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. My cheeks, my cheeks. Right then, so yeah, that was a train simulator in VR. Uh, so yeah, if you do have this, you have a PC, and you have a VR headset, it's worth trying out. You can go and download the uh, UR EV. I'm bringing up UEVR. Uh, yeah, it was really easy. Just started up the program, inserted it into the game, and that was it, really. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to leave it there for now. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you all have a great day. I'm going to go and cough some more. Bye-bye.